on the PSA World Tour. Kareem Darwish has done a tremendous job as the promoter for this event. But look at the names that we have. Uh, the Warrior Princess, who's in unbelievable form in Group A. Kamis Cern, the sole non-Egyptian, who will be battling it out in this best of three format. And then in Group B, Hanya El Hamami, who's the young sensation. But it's Amanda Sobi, Sarah Jane Perry and Joel King, who will be also battling for that one and two spot to qualify for the later stages of this event. Good shot from nice. Blow Harbour. It was a misread from Hanny there. You just see here, just moves up. Doesn't break it. She's certainly on the ropes here with Blow Harbour. Lovely control from Hanny. Yeah. Game to oh, what a shot that is. Absolute scandal. Gut ripping boast from Hanny. She looks on fine form. The Terminator needs to find a direction. The old red light in the eyes is fading. Direction. Oh, superbly well. That's another loose shot there from Gohar. I mean, this is a really good example of, of a player that is really controlling good. the pace of the match. You can see Gohar wanting to go quick. Great shot. Great shot. See from Goha's reaction there, she knows how important it is to gain balls to equalise in this first match of tonight's play. Oh, that's a great shot. Great shot there to finish this second game from Goha. Terrific quality from the Terminator in response. That was an absolute belter from Goha. Seven, two. See, I can definitely, having not played a World Tour Finals myself, but definitely played some best of threes. <laughs> found it very stressful, considering he used to come back from two love down and lose three two. Well, that is a lovely shot from Goha. The backhand has been pretty outrageous. That's I mean, that outrageous. that's that's already that's got to be clipped as. <laughs> of the matches of the event. Shot. We're only on the first match. Eight match balls, oh, and she's finished again. it on the backhand volley this time. So the Terminator has certainly opened up with a very impressive match against a hugely, hugely dangerous person in the form of Salma Hani. 52 minutes minus. A good 15 minutes for the intermission with the lights, but what a top quality game of squash to open up tonight's proceedings. Naronga Ha converting two games to one. Oh, 
Wow. The blistering start from Sam. Yeah, she really has come out. And again, out. beautiful. Just... There for Shabini. That's well played. Very, very well played. Switch the plate. A lot of wrist. Oh, wow. What a shot that is. What a shot that is from Noah El Shabini. High up on the forehand side. Took the pace off the ball. Beautiful shot to close this first game out. Unbelievable dexterity. She was on tiptoe on that shot, on a bit of a, a knife edge, but also making on four stairs. Oh. What an athlete. <laughs> oh my oh, goodness, wow. me. that was outrageous. Unbelievable. Talk about panth a panther pouncing across the tee. Oh my oh, goodness me. Great. Put too much into this, Joey. At 8 1 down in this second game, or is she going to let it go a little bit? This is the interesting factor with somebody like Shabini that can win points so quickly and has got that attitude of every point is like match point. I think from this point, I think she would just keep fighting back. She back herself to be able to clock up those points. Six behind for her. Oh. So La Panther takes the second game, racing ahead with the early lead, holding on. Been no let up at all. Again, the volley lob, a terrific shot from Sermon there, changing the angle, and it is always <coughs> a lovely feeling when your opponent guesses oh, match balls to get a massive, massive win over the current world number three. She's done it. She's done it. So a couple of claps there for Camille Serm. He's just beaten the world number one. What a terrific effort from her. A blistering, blistering display of squash from both these girls. And actually, she seemed to win Nor El Shabini. Very impressed. Psychologically beach after losing that tie break first game, she didn't half respond and then she just got stronger and stronger. That was a very impressive performance there from Camille Sun. No doubt about that. And you could see what it meant to her there after 35 minutes coming out on top. And like you say, after losing the tie break, the 12 10 in the in the first game, you know, from a mental perspective, reacting to that and putting together you know, a second and third game like she has done. Very, very impressive.
again. Just something was slightly three. loose on the volley. El Hamami dealing with forehand or backhand. Game balls here for Tania in this first game. And she doesn't require any yeah, more yeah, yeah. because yeah, she's just flattened that ball straight yeah, into the cross court nick off the service. Absolutely ripped that one. Blair is resumed in 60 seconds. And now, for all. So another beautiful shot into the front backhand corner from Hania. Just a bit too short on a length. A victory of tonight's play. Oh, wow, that's a poor mistake. SJ will not be very happy with that as a final shot. Seven, wanting to repractice it. She's nose pointing to the back of the court. She went for the short one, found the tin. So Hanya El Hamami, very, very happy to score. 31 minute, two love victory here tonight. She is the number two seed, but she's got serious history with Sarah Jane Perry. And it was going all the way to the wire in that second.